Good morning. Oh, I'll clean that up. Start over again. There we go. Still looks fuzzy. Fuzzy. Oh well. Good morning. Bill just dropped us off. We're getting ready to um, go out. I am in my rain gear. So you may not see the phone much. We had a wonderful zero day yesterday. Sat around and did just about nothing. I read a book. Um, treated my arm for the bee sting. It's still growing. Story of my life. Nothing seriously takes me off the trail. It just happens to have some struggles. So we're going to do about 19.7 miles today. We're going to Rainbow Springs campsite. And yeah, just nice day in the rain. Hopefully I can take you out sometime when it stops raining and we'll show you some things. Trail confessional. Oh. So, I have two days. One day on trail, tomorrow, and then I summit. It's been a long time coming. I hit my um, four month mark the other day, and that was pretty cool to hit four months. Um, but four months on the trail, that's crazy. I mean, I did a week in Utah, but still four months. That is super crazy for me. Anyway, things are getting close, coming to the end. Look at the pond over there. That's all we've been doing is going around ponds. We go up and over hills to the next pond, go around the pond, going up and over a hill to the next pond, go around the pond, <laughs> which would be fine and fun if it was warm, but it isn't been so rainy and the trail is so rooty and rocky that it's hard to sit here and talk and do the video but it's getting close to the end and it's hard to believe that I'm gonna finish this I'm gonna finish this and that's that's just crazy that's crazy that's crazy crazy <laughs> I'm on my way it's after four o'clock and we're heading to our campsite, Rainbow Springs campsite. And it's about three miles, so I have an hour and a half. About is it four o'clock? Five o'clock, sorry, five o'clock. So I should be getting there about 6.15. Um, if I can keep my tempo up. I try and do a little bit quicker than two miles per hour. Because I can, except for some of these rooty, rocky places. But yeah, I really can't believe this is almost done. I can't believe I've gone through all the states I've gone through. I can't believe I've gone through, I'm almost done with Maine. Like literally, there's 12 miles we'll pick up tomorrow to go into Baxter State Park. And then we'll do nine miles into Baxter, into the campsite after lunch. We're getting up super early in the morning. But it's coming so fast. Ron's on his way. He's going to be in Massachusetts tonight. Um, and I have no service. Hold on just a second. Hey, how's it going? Hey. Good. Good. <laughs> just passed somebody as I'm talking to him on my phone. Um, he'll be in just outside of Springfield, Mass. And then he'll be here on the 3rd, which is the day that we're going to be 
which is tomorrow, which is tomorrow. He'll, he'll actually be here tomorrow. Uh, Cappy will be here, Whistler's wife will be in tomorrow. So they'll see us on the 4th. Um, I think we decided that we're just gonna summit without them. Cappy's knee is bothering her and not the time to be doing that. And logistically, it's just easier if we go up and have them meet us at the end or we'll meet them at the hotel. We'll hitchhike into Millinocket. Just depends on what time it is. If it's not even close to three, when we get off the mountain, we'll just hitchhike into Millinocket and surprise them. So that's a long trail confessional. Trail confessional, it's getting real. Mm -hmm.